welcome to the final uh, BGE literacy session of the week. We've had a look at a combination of writing and reading this week. And the past few sessions have been about reading for enjoyment and trying to find things that are either engaging or fun to read. Again, this is a second part of an extract from Bill Bryson's book. He's an author that I can really relate to. And in this particular case, he's talking about his paper round when he was much, much younger. Over the course of this week, we've been learning to use the Read and Write for Google Chrome. It is a very powerful tool. And let me just go through it quickly again with you. So the first thing we're going to do is learn how to do the digital reader. So what we can do is we can highlight the text like so. We go up to the taskbar at the top and we press play. The other danger of rich people was their dogs. And it plays it for us, which is great. The other aspect we've got is a dictionary. We often come across words that we find difficult to read because we don't know what they sound like. And also we don't know what they mean. So let's have a quick look at a word in here that we want to try and look at. So we've got inhabiting. Let's take this word here. We highlight it like so. We go up to the dictionary icon and it will tell us what it is. More importantly, it will tell us what it sounds like. Inhabiting, inhabiting. Excellent. And the final tool that we've learned to use this week is the highlighter tool. The highlighter tool is really important because sometimes in class, when you're given large texts that can be quite daunting and scary to read, you can actually just highlight small sections of it. It's that kind of tip of being able to take it into small chunks. And this can be really handy if you find it quite hard to focus on particular lines whilst you're reading. Today's exercise and the past few days are all about reading for enjoyment and engagement. And what I'd really like you to do is read the disparate extract from Bill Bryson and actually have a go at looking at some of the vocabulary in there using Read and Write for Google Chrome. It can be used in your class, on your Chromebooks, and any device that you have with a Highland Council Google login. It's very powerful and very effective. There's a Google form in the description below, and I look forward to seeing your responses. Thank you for your hard work this week.